I beg your pardon. Yeah. Yeah. No, I probably forgot that. Yeah, that's why, that's why you didn't go. Oh, right, I probably forgot. Yeah. Was... <laughs> oh, right, oh, okay. So are you. Yeah. Uh, who knows? I've got to live with it. Oh, okay. 
to do another four years, so I'm still the standard bear, when it's the RAF said to you, two years. Yeah. Yeah. So I would ask that. memorabilia. Yeah. I think one of the things that's difficult to remember about the first world war is how crude technology was. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, for us today, we're used to you know, really very sophisticated technology. Yeah. Yes. I mean, photography was really intense. Yeah. Yeah. They were using a um, glass plate. Yes. And, uh, you imagine trying to do glass plate photography on the battlefield. Well, some of the stuff they got was well, so Yeah. Too. Yeah. Yes. Yes. No, that's okay. You carry on. It's a living event. Are you, are you selling copies of this? I'm giving them away. I'm giving them to you. Good man. Hello. I think so. John Morgan. I wish I'd known it. I mean, I was early anyway, but I'd come in The amount of research that's gone into this, I think, is absolutely amazing. I mean, obviously, some of it is, I think it's part of a, you know, get the places national, but is that the point of stuff? There's an awful lot of local stuff. A lot, a lot of local stuff. Amazing. Names I've heard being read out at uh, yeah. Remembrance Sundays for decades. Yeah. I'm here again, so.
It's a very, very wide angle. Not, you're colour blind, is it? <laughs> yes, I'm colour blind, yeah. <laughs> I love the white, not the red. It's just yeah. his excuse. No, he, he drinks half the bottle of red and then goes back and said, No, he gave me red instead yeah. of white. I didn't like that. I love it. I'll try another one. Yeah. Hello, how are you? Hi. 